we're going to convert the point negative 3 comma 3, the rectangular point negative 3 comma 3 into a polar into polar coordinates. So the best way to think about this is to think about that point negative 3 comma 3. And where would that be? That would be 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. That would be your point right there. Negative 3 comma 3. It's right there. And we're going to draw it that line right there, we want to find the radius and we want to find the angle theta. Whoops. We want to find the angle theta. That's how we convert it to rectangular. We find r comma theta. Those two values are comma theta. So how do we do that? Well, r is pretty easy to find. I'll do r in red. To find r, I need to take this triangle right here which is up three left three and I need to find R well that's a 45 45 90 if you remember your special right triangle rules it's just it's just three root two R equals three root two that's all it is okay got it all right that's that was easy now the, the other part is what's the angle theta let's do that in blue the angle theta is going to be that angle right there, well I know, like I just said, that that angle right there, they want it in radians too, by the way, that angle right there, if it's a, if it's a isosceles tri right triangle, what kind of triangle is it? What angles are those? Pi four. Pi over four, right, or 45. So we know that that angle right there is pi over four. If that angle is pi over four, what's theta? What's my standard angle right there? It's pi over four. 3 pi over 4. It's, it's pi minus pi over 4, which is 3 pi over 4. So there's your answer. Your polar coordinates are 3 root 2, comma, 3 pi over 4. Done.